guys, Sagittarius. I'm Miss Miss Be a Blessing. Today is July 22nd, 2019, and this is your reading for today. If you're new to my channel, please take a moment to like, subscribe, comment. That being said, we're going to get into this reading here. I see that you're definitely at a crossroads. You need to make a head of all decision in regard to someone in your life. I do see there's going to be new love, new opportunities, doors of opportunity that's going to be opening up for you here, and celebrations is on the horizon. I've also seen that you've been dealing with a whole lot of competition here where somebody's definitely patching judgment on you in regard to some things. I do see you're looking on for bigger and brighter things within your life and this is a witch card so things are going to happen for you it's going to happen at a fast pace you have a leo card here this is a sun card as well so it's saying that you're definitely going to receive a whole lot of happiness in your life but i see you're still dealing with a double situation which is saying that you're dealing with some type of toxic situation you could be in a relationship with somebody where you're feeling bounded and tied to this person you're loving them and all that good stuff but there's a whole lot of tumultuous Things going on in this relationship, you don't know what to do. Somebody could be drinking too much, drinking too much, or just fucking lying and being more um, manipulative, you know, playing games. Um, somebody could definitely be obsessing over you, or vice versa, or both. I mean, it is what it is. <laughs> and there's a whole lot of lusting going on. I do see here, too, that it's all about giving and receiving. You got to know that. And I do see you feel as though you've been carrying a heavy load for a very long time. The good thing about this card is that the ending is to that situation is about to take place. Because your ship is coming in on a rising. You have a king of wands here. Now, this could be you standing on um, power or another fire sign that could be interested in you, Sagittarius, or Leo, or uh, another Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries. I see you're going to be birthing out some new exciting things. Somebody could definitely be pregnant here. I see somebody feeling as though they left out in the cold. And there definitely were some harsh words that were spoken. You see his face? He ain't playing. Somebody, there's a man here that feels as though he had, he said some fucked up words. It could be vice versa. Y'all know how terror or tower is. It could be either or. Take it. Get in where the fuck you fit in with that. I do see here you working this stream hard. It's definitely going to pay off for you. And there's a water sign here. The water sign is feeling like there's some type of betrayal going on with this situation. Something is not what it appears to be. So if you're dealing with the water sign, be careful. Somebody could be trying to steal something from you. They've been lying, deceptive, and deceitful here. And I see that you've definitely been um, defending yourself in regard to this situation. You've been fighting against a whole lot of people. This is you, but these are other ones where other people are fighting against you here, but you're holding your own ground. I see somebody has been crying in their emotions in regard to how to be a lover's relationship that's not too much working out. A fool card is saying you're going to jump out and do something new and exciting, said the tears, and it's going to work out for you here with the high priestess and following your intuition in regard to everything that goes on with you in your life. And check this out. You got the star card again. You got this star card, and then you got the star view card up here. But this deck just has two or certain cards. So that's saying that you have two wishes that's definitely going to be fulfilled. Let's see. Um, There's a partnership that you want that's going to definitely work out. And somebody's wishing and hoping that it do. But yeah, somebody's juggling two people here. And, and somebody's definitely leaning toward more toward one person than the other. I do see a fire sign that's coming in towards you here, Sagittarius. And you might have a few choice words for that is that you have to say, but communication is definitely the key to this situation. It's time for movement to take place. Somebody's going to be moving here, and somebody's definitely going to walk away from a situation, walk away from people, place, and things that no longer serve them. This is you standing in your own really because you need a balance in your life. There's reminiscence of the past here is what I'm saying, Sagittarius. Hmm. Now, there's a Knight of Cups coming in. You see the cup? Coming in with a big ass cup, and then if you look on his cheek, he wants love. So he definitely in his emotions a whole lot and want love from you. But there's some other ulterior motive as well. Because why the heart got to be so goddamn small if he coming in with this big ass cup? So this motherfucker here, this water sign, is going to be very emotional when it comes to this lover's relationship. Check me out. Check, see what I'm saying now? You do have an earth sign that's coming towards you as well. Very financial savvy person who's going to come in and help you with your finance and things of that sort. Could be a business partner. I also see financial increase on the horizon for you here. And in a lover's relationship, check this out. Now, this is a lover's relationship. Somebody is very much lusty over somebody. Once you see how one snake is dominating over the other, well, somebody is domineering over another person. Yes, there is love here because you see the flowers. There's love here, yes. Definitely love and the sex is great. 
This is somebody who can walk the fine line with you. They can go with you to your dark times and your light time. It is what the fuck it is. It's up to you to say if you want to deal with them or not. But definitely, like I said, somebody's overpowering somebody within a lover's relationship. There's plenty of kissing and hugging and things of that sort that could be taking place here. Lots of love, lots of sex. All right, take it for what it is. Shit. I'm just reading the cards. I see that you're honing in on your skills. Mm -hmm. Somebody could be going back to school here to learn a little bit more. There's going to be plenty of offers that's coming in for you, Sagittarius. Look at all the offers. Be careful when choosing because not all offers is good for you. This is because it look good don't mean it's good for you. Somebody is definitely in their emotion. They're crying over something that's spilled. Ain't shit you could do about that. Turn around and look at the two foot cuts behind you because somebody wants to offer you some dub. She can't see because her motherfucking eyes is closed. Open up your goddamn eyes and stop being in your emotions in regard to that and turn around because you got blessings right behind you. All right? I do see the happy home life and things of that sort that's going to come into play for you here. And you have a Leo here that's standing out, but it's telling you to stand in your strength. Look at that beautiful infinity sign. Stand in your strength in regard to this situation. Somebody definitely want to offer you a whole lot of sex. You see this one? That's a big ass one. That's a big up. What it look like at the top. Okay. Somebody wants sex here. Somebody's a very creative individual that's coming into your life. And they do want love. You see the flowers? Somebody wants love with you. But it's more so too. Somebody wants to have sex with you. And they want to birth out some new sight and things with you. Because you see the leaves coming out the one. That's birthing out new sight and things. They want the happy home life. They want to live, live with you and be with you and things of that sort. But this is all up to you. It's a very creative time for you. It's up to you if you want to create that with that individual. The magician card is saying that you're manifesting some good things to come into your life. You have all the tools you need so in order to do so. See? Somebody's doing some type of magic because look at the rose with the that's a, that's a sword going through it but you know like in voodoo when you use these that's more like a stick pen that's just a representation where somebody's sticking that through one in a lover's relationship with somebody or trying to fuck up somebody's lover's relationship so they can get in where they fit in because look at that somebody won't love from somebody with this cup over here you see what I'm saying there will be some crying, so somebody's probably trying to break up a lover's relationship with somebody because I see crying over here, but yet they want to love you as well. Somebody want to love somebody, so they're going to willing to work on fucking up somebody else's relationship so they can get in and leave the other person crying. All right, now, go ahead and speak, Spear. <laughs> somebody's definitely in their mind in regard to you here. You've been thinking a whole, whole lot in regard to a lot of things that's going on in your life, and that's a great thing. Queen of Wands, you have a Leo Sage of Aries that's definitely thinking about you here. Now, I just looked at these cards. Now, you look at her hand. When you deal with a fire sign, you got to be very careful. Because look on her hand. She says burn. Look at that shit. That, that's telling you right away. So, if she was in the reverse, but she's not. She's in the upright. She's coming in the upright. So, this is a fire sign. Leo Sage of Aries that's coming towards you here. Somebody who wants to be seen with you because there's a mirror here. Somebody wants to be seen with you. They want to birth out some new exciting things with you here. See what else do I see in here that the cards or the spirits want to tell me? Somebody wants to be in love with you here. Birthing on new exciting things. Oh, yeah. See? Two birds together. Oh, most definitely. They want things to work out. They want togetherness here. Passion is here and working together with the leaves and the green. All right, y'all. Shit, I see celebrations on the horizon here. Somebody's going to be celebrating some parties. There could be some weddings and things of that sort. See the candles lit. And it's all about love. Somebody's going to be celebrating something that's very good. This is a lover's relationship. All right. Let's see what your last two cards. You have a Scorpio here, so this could be a Scorpio that's could definitely thinking about you. There's going to be endings and new beginnings. This person does love you. I'm not saying that they don't love you. They want to be with you and things of that sort. You have somebody has shed some tears in regard to this situation. Look at that. Look at the butterfly. Yep, changes. Metamorphosing into something different. New beginnings. Look on this crest right here. That's another rose and things of that sort as well. Somebody's telling somebody to be quiet in regard to something. Even though they're going through a whole lot of pain, you don't have to speak about your pain so much. 
You're going to go through it. You're going to get through it. And things are going to work out. This is the endings of a new beginnings, but there's new love here as well. And somebody feels like they just fuck. They're on guard now. And then, you know, you once you be hurt, you have to be guarded. That being said, stay the test. I hope you enjoyed this reading. Please like, subscribe, comment to my channel. Remember, I'm supposed to be a blessing. Y'all have a very blessed day. Thank you so very much. Have a very blessed day.